Hello everyone, my name is Tony with Picture Keeper Support. Today I'm going to show you how to view your pictures on a Windows 10 machine. It could be a laptop or a desktop. Um, the first thing you do is plug your Picture Keeper into the USB slot of your laptop. Okay. Sometimes you'll see a little pop-up in the bottom. Um, there's nothing wrong with the drive. All you have to do is click on this X and the window will open up automatically. Double click on this Launch Picture Keeper and that's to start our Picture Keeper software. If, you're, if your Windows, when you plug it in and the window doesn't automatically open up, I'm gonna show you how to access it manually. The first thing you do is on the bottom, there's this little yellow folder called File Explorer. Left click on it one time and your File Explorer opens up. And then you can see, um, if you click on this PC, you'll see my devices and drives. I have a C drive, I have a D drive, and I have a PK backup drive. So I'm gonna double click on the PK backup drive. And there it is, Launch Picture Keeper. Double click on Launch Picture Keeper. And that starts up our desktop software. The first thing you do when you see this screen, the Welcome to Picture Keeper, is you want to make sure you have the latest version. On the bottom left, there is the version number. And if it says latest version, that means you have the latest version. If it says update needed, um, please get, click on it to update. You want the latest versions because we always have new improvements and new features added. So another way to update it is click on this gear icon top right and then select update picture keeper. I'm already running the latest version. So how do you view? On the left hand side, click on this view and print and I see three folders. Um, whenever you do a backup, picture keeper creates one folder for every machine or device that you back up. So that's how you differentiate between devices. Now there's a number in parentheses that tells you how many pictures there are inside that folder. So I'm gonna double click into my Galaxy S9 folder. I see a camera folder and I see these numbers. So my camera has 1,873. I'm gonna double click on it. And there they are, there's my pictures. Um, if I want to, there's a little scroll thing down here. You can scroll all the way down. If you want to scroll, see all your pictures. If you see your pictures and they're spinning, that means it's just trying to populate. And while it's spinning, it's pop, you're trying to populate. So just be, be patient and you will see your pictures. Um, if you want to go back a level, it's really easy. There's top left, there's a little back button, click back and then you can choose a different folder, okay? Ooh, my new boat. Um, you can click on the back button and then click on, if you wanna actually, you can actually click on the folder itself, right? The folder name and you can go back as well. So let me show you how to view again. You go in the folder, double click on the folder. and There you go. That's how you see your pictures. If you want to, sort your files okay uh, up top there's a little sort files you click on oldest first let it spin there you go i see my pictures sorted um, if you see your pictures that are crooked or slanted an easy way to fix is double clicking on it to blow it up change the rotate Okay, rotate to the correct orientation and click on X. That's how you fix it if you have a picture that's going the wrong way. Go back, let me go to camera. There they are, fixed. If you wanna see your pictures blown up, you can use the slider, go big or little, right? Slide it to the right for enlargement, slide to the left to minimize, smaller. If you want to search, um, you can type it in if you know the name or the year, you type it in here to search in the text box. If you need, and that's it, that's how you view your pictures. If you need any help, additional help or support, email me at support at picturekeeper.com. Thank you.